When Tampa Bay resident Carolyn Magzuga retired from nursing, she never expected to face a silent killer that took her away from her family. I was lying in bed one night and I felt the pulsation in my abdomen and it just didn't feel right. It was like your heart pounding in your abdomen. Carolyn went to her doctor who diagnosed her with AAA or abdominal aortic aneurysm. It's a generalized weakening of the wall of the aorta. The aorta is the main tube carrying blood flow from the heart uh, down to the lower legs and the most common location of an aortic aneurysm is in the abdomen. This is the uh, aneurysm that was up in the lower portion of the chest. Experts say more than one million Americans are living today with undiagnosed AAA because there are few symptoms. If aneurysms like this burst, only 10 to 25 percent of the people will survive. But there's a good screening tool, a 10-minute ultrasound, just like the ones done during pregnancy. Very simple test, uh, non-invasive, uh, reliable and accurate. A fast test that can be done within uh, 10 to 15 minutes, uh, and it's readily available uh, through, through uh, medical clinics and hospitals. Doctors treated Carolyn's AAA with blood pressure medication, with ultrasounds every six months, and eventually when it kept growing, with surgery to repair it. They cut out the piece that was blowing out and they put in a graft. Now Carolyn just wants to get the word out about the screening tool as well as the risk factors. Well, I have five grown children now and uh, they know and at least three of them are on hypertensive medication because I've told them the importance of it. Risk factors for AAA include being 60 or older, a history of smoking, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, heart disease, or family history. Find the Answers is a public education campaign that offers information on AAA and on their website. They have this risk assessment test that you can take. They'll also let you know about free screening events that they hold across the United States. If you'd like more information on any of that, go to abcactionnews.com or my Facebook fan page and we'll link you to their website. Brendan?